the wonderful people welcome back to my channel this is onyx for you i'm so so glad to have you back thank you if you're just coming to my channel for the first time please subscribe so you'll be notified whenever i post a new video in today's video i'm simply going to show you how to make chicken stew from scratch i have some fresh chicken here i'm using a whole chicken i have to make soup puree here, I made this a while ago. I'm going to put a link below on how you can prepare your tomato puree at home. I have here 3 medium onion chopped, 2 bay leaves, pepper flakes, dry thyme, curry, ginger and garlic, they are all crushed, some stock cubes and salt. I'm going to list out the quantity of ingredients in the description box. Please do check it out. And for the ingredients you can add whatever you like these are the ones I'm going with I don't want to add so much ingredients keep watching for this chicken stew I'm going to start by boiling my chicken I told you I was going to show you how to make this from scratch so what I'm going to do is to use parts of these ingredients to season this so I will start by seasoning this with two chicken stock cubes you can add more, maybe just to test. I'm going to be adding in half a teaspoon of turmeric powder. I love to use turmeric to season my chicken. I'm adding in half a teaspoon of dry thyme, some ground pepper, half a teaspoon. I just shade the ginger and the garlic into two equal parts, then add to it to season. And finally, I'm adding in salt. Just make sure you season your chicken until it's very tasty. Once I'm done, I'll like to stir this up to combine. Then add water just enough to cook the chicken and then place this on here to cook. So as you're cooking this, don't forget to add your onions. I almost forgot the onions. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Now the chicken is soft, so I'm going to put soft heat. Decide whether you want to bake your chicken or fry it using oil. So for me, I decided to fry my chicken and not bake. That's left for you to decide. Once you're done frying your chicken or baking it, set it aside for now. It will be needed later. Right here we are going to start making the stew. What I did was to place the pot, then add the oil I used to fry the chicken. So now I'm going to add in garlic and ginger to stir fry. I'm going to stir fry this until fragrant. I also love to add in the chopped onion. Once the onions is translucent, I'm going to add in the tomato puree. For this chicken stew, I'm not using tomato paste. You can use that. I just decided not to use tomato paste because my tomato puree is really much. Most times I prepare my stew with either tomato paste or I combine both. I'm going to put a lid over it and allow it to cook for 10 minutes. So while this was cooking, I made sure I stayed this intermittently. Some of the liquid has reduced, so we are going to start seasoning this. I'm going to start by adding curry powder, half a teaspoon, thyme, half a teaspoon. I'll be adding in the remaining stock cubes. Some pepper flakes just to test. Just a pinch of salt. After I've added all this, I'm going to stir this, then add some chicken stock to it. This is the rich chicken stock we got from boiling the chicken. I'm adding in the bay leaves. I'm going to place the lid over it and make sure the stew is properly cooked. I've cooked this for about 10 minutes. We stir everything up to combine, then test for seasoning. If there's any need for other seasoning, just make sure you are just at this point you're going to bring in the baked or the fried chicken. This still tastes really nice. I 
I'm sure you would love to try this out. I love to stir everything up until it combines. The few spices I use have given me what I want. The flavor is awesome. So I'm going to leave this to cook for 5 minutes. So at this point our chicken stew is ready. So guys, your chicken stew is ready. What would you love to have this with? There are so many options. You can serve this with plantain, boiled yam or boiled rice. As for me, I'm pairing this with rice. This was how to prepare a simple delicious chicken stew. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you regret this recipe. Let me know what you think. Subscribe to my channel, like my video and also share this with your friends. Until next time, bye!